Hello YouTube, welcome to episode 66 of our Final Fantasy IX side quest challenge series. Um, yeah, this episode we are going to grab all the Ragtime Mouse encounters, well, or at least as many as we can. We're going to do some frog catching first and uh, then we're going to dig out the choker graphs as well. So uh, I'm not going to show everything, I'm just going to skip through the, um, well, interesting parts, I guess. Um, so yeah, let's, uh, let's go frog catching first. There we go, that went fast, that went fast. That is 74. Uh, so yeah, that's not too bad. So let's head towards the second Q's March now. well as well that went really well man the last two have been uh, have been quite have been quite good um yeah but I like f for this one I've kind of found a I don't know if it's a glitch but um yeah uh, when you um when you like press the the sides and I just kept keep tapping X uh, the moment the frog jumps you will catch it um, so far I've only had it with the uh, Q's March on the um, on the outer continent, but it's it makes it a whole lot easier. But yeah, 86, 86, not bad, and one Q's March to go. So we'll end in uh, in the 90s. So that is not bad. That's not bad. That means in uh, well probably next disc or or next time I try, uh, we'll get uh, yeah we'll get to 99 and uh, eventually have to fight Master Quali. So uh, yeah. But anyway, now uh, let's let's finish this round of frog catching up. There we go. <laughs> so I guess it works as well. I think it works as well when you do it uh, in the other queues marches. Just hug the hug the sides of the pond and uh, and press X. Well, that makes it easy. That makes it easy. Um, but yeah, and even this was the is, is the most difficult queues march to get frogs, but it, it went well. So we had uh, 91 frogs, uh, not bad, not bad at all. Um, considering we ended the, well we started this episode with 69 frogs I think, so yeah, definitely not bad. Um, what was then seven? No, six, 69 frogs I think. Um, so now it's up to the next thing, and I think that's going to be the ragtime mouse encounters. Um, but I don't know what forest I would like to do. Uh, maybe I should try one of the outer continent forests? I don't know. Or maybe, well, since we're in Lindblom anyway, we might as well do some... Well, might as well do some uh, forests in Lindblom. Okay, this is something new. And I bet it's gonna be the Rectile Mouse, because there is no friendly monster I have to encounter here. So I do believe I, I don't know, because I'm, I'm down at Limblum, at the exit of Limblum, so I kind of have a feeling it does follow the order kind of a bit, like the order where I would normally go uh, in, in the story. Okay, Chocobo Forest is located between Limblum and Southgate. Uh, is it Southgate or Northgate? No, it's Southgate, because Northgate goes to goes well it's up because Limblum is down <laughs> anyway it's 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 definitely true it's definitely true i think <laughs> yeah it's true so uh wait that's i always <laughs> always want to check with like a red circle kind of means wrong as well i don't know it's it's a bit confusing but yeah i actually changed um quina i switched i just quit switched quina for freya again so, uh, yeah, she will get the, uh, is it a thousand kill again? I thought it was more. Um, but yeah, so she will get the uh, AP, which is good, because she has to learn quite a bit. And I just noticed that we don't get AP for this. Huh. <laughs> well, that kind of sucks. Uh, well, I switch her anyway for the fights that I'm doing, uh, because I do grab a few of them. Um, but yeah, that's interesting. 
Um, but yeah, let's uh, let's head off to Bermisha and uh, let's see if I can get a uh, a ragtime mouse encounter there. <laughs> nice, the first encounter, and it's a, and it's a ragtime mouse. <laughs> oh wow, I am definitely gonna continue down the world map as the story progressed. Oh wow, that was definitely the way to go. Well, that is um, that is very fortunate. That is very fortunate. Okay, let's see. Pop quiz. Question number three. The 15th Lindbrun Blumois started in 1600. Uh, I have absolutely no idea, uh, but if I remember, that was false. Yes, that was false. I'm trying to I'm trying to recollect, um, but that is false. It doesn't matter really if you have 100% correct or not. However, I do hope I have it right. Nice. Phew. Yeah, I, uh, I remember it correctly. A thousand. I thought you got more every single time. I'm surprised. I thought it was like two, two thousand, three thousand, four thousand. Well, not in increments by a thousand, but I thought it was. I thought it increased, maybe after a few times. Okay, wow. <laughs> Up to. Well, after Bumisia, we went to. Uh, and yeah, outer continent basically because we followed Kuja. So let's go. Uh, yeah, let's go to the outer continent again. All right, next one. Ah, oh, I'm 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 quite happy. It's mostly the the first encounter you have in a forest. So if you don't have a first encounter in the forest, I would say move to the next one. All right, <laughs> four, well, not four down, we still need to do this one. All right, question four. One of your canary was written, written by Lord Avon. I think it's Lord Avon, uh, with, with a V, not with an, with an F. So, yeah, that is false. Yeah, it's written by Lord Avon. So, that is the X. It's always Amaranth who's first with the right time, I've noticed. Should be correct. <laughs> Yay! Cool. Two thousand gil. Ah, they upped it. That's cool. That's cool. Well, not <laughs> not that I need the money, but yeah. Cool. <laughs> Wow, this is going well. This is going really well. Already fifth question. And I haven't been playing that long. I think since the last question I had one fight or two fights. So yeah, not too bad at all. Let's see. Theater ship Prima Vista was used... Oh, theater ship Prima Vista used the mist as its source of energy. I believe that is true. Because it's one of the... Well, Regular ships. Uh, that was true. Yes. Go, Vivi! <laughs> Correct! 2000th again. I think next time it's like. Well, not next time, but like the. the well. Next time when it goes up, I think it'll be 5,000 maybe. I think the, the last one is 10,000 gil. I'm not sure though. It doesn't really matter for the gil. There we go. First encounter again. Nice. It's a really easy way to actually know whether or not it's going to be a um, rectile mouse encounter. So you don't really lose a lot of time in the forests. It's kind of, well not kind of, it's, which is really good. Pop quiz! Question number six. Ber Berkmere cable cars have been running for eight years. That is true. Uh, yeah. Oh, 
always waits quite a while to like give the answer. Like give the answer, but do it. Mention it correct or not. Yay, go Amaranth! Ooh, 3,000 already, nice! I got a hundred... I'm an expert! You bet I am! There we go! Very good, very good! This is going well! Wow, I can't, I can't believe that we never had a, a, a ragtime mouse encounter before. But I think, I, I really think we needed to do them kind of in order. Like, go to Alexandria first, then Limblum, then, like, move up. Uh, it, it shouldn't be, though, but, yeah. I don't know, let's see what the question is. Fossil Roo is a tunnel that connects Trino and Alexandria. Uh, wait, is it Trino and Alexandria or Trino and Lim Limblum? Fossil Roo connects Trino and Alexandria. No, it goes from... Yeah, it goes to Limblum because they crash at Pinnacle Rock, so it's... That is false. Yes, that is false. That is false. Yeah, it's it's Trino to Lindblum. Yes. Oh, hurry. I am hurrying. I even paused the game. Should be right, though. It's not Alexandria. Although... No, it connects... No, it connects Lindblum and Alexandria. It passes by Trino. Yeah, there's a thing because you you do. Yeah, yeah, you end up in you end up in Alexandria as well. Yeah, yeah. Jeez, I, I was right, but for the wrong reason. <gasps> At least I was right. <laughs> man, man, man. This is going really well. It's from one ragtime mouse encounter to the other. Sweet! Do, 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 do. Only... Red question... Seven? Now? Or eight? Question eight. Of sixteen. We're halfway through. Limo class is large. Yeah, it's definitely larger than Alexandria Castle. It's incredibly uh, larger. Uh, true. I am hurrying, jeez. They don't call it Lindblum Grand Castle for nothing. Correct. 4,000 gil. Yeah, they sung to up the uh, price. You're on a roll. I know I am. Ah, oh, man. <laughs> Question number nine. Only six, seven more to go. Well, after this, six. Not bad, not bad. <laughs> Limon cars operate around the clock. Yes, they do. Yes, they do. Correct. Well, it, it will be correct. That would be so annoying if you go to Lindblum and it's like, I'm sorry, the cars don't operate. You have to. I don't know. Actually, they could do it and then and you have to kind of stay in the inn to spend the night or something like that. I don't know. Although it would be annoying, I think. Yeah. It, it would be it would be more kind of realistic feature, I guess. Although. In, in, in real life, trains trains operate around the clock as well. Uh, well, not really around the clock, but they... they, they uh, There are night trains and, and stuff like that. But yeah. Alright, let's see if... Um, if we get another encounter here right away. Would be really cool. Only six more to go. Come on, mouse. Come on, mouse. No. There we go. All right. So seven questions, not not six questions as I said a minute ago, but seven now. Six after this. Pop quiz. Question number ten. 
Some moves are friendly and don't attack. That is true, the friendly moves. As our, you know, in, in the name, fr friendly move. I've not really done the friendly move, I think we have. We still need to do friendly ghost, friendly Garuda, and then friendly Yan. And actually fight friendly Yan first. Because he is one of the optional super bosses. Which I've never done before. I've never done the I've never done all the friendly monsters, I think. I'm not sure if I've done them in the past. But yeah, I've definitely not fought the end. So that's gonna be interesting. There we go, finally. This took a while, but uh yeah, I thought like let's go let's go back to the Mist Continent. It might be useful, and yes it is. Um yeah. I don't know, I don't know if I have to, like, follow a certain path or not. But, yeah, I think the Mist Continent is the place to be for the moment. Alright, question number 11. Only one desert exists in the entire world. No, that's false. That is definitely, definitely false. There we go. Yeah, that was, that was definitely not an, uh, a difficult question. Correct! Well done, Freya! 5,000 gil. 100% correct! I'm an expert! Hell yes! Cool, cool! Alright, finally! I guess it took... Alexandra had to get another encounter. Ah, oh, five more to go. All right, here we go. Question number 12. Kondopiti is a village of goblins. That is false. It's a village of dwarves. Dwarves? I think that, yeah, they're dwarves. Or at least not goblins. And it is correct! Correct! There we go. Alrighty, up to the next one. 6,000 gil. Thank you very much. Good, good. Man, I'm slowly starting to forget what forests I've done and which I haven't. Because I'm not sure, but I don't know if you can encounter them in the same forest twice. Um, I don't think so. But yeah. There's only three more, so it shouldn't be too bad. But yeah, it's, <laughs> it's hard to keep track of it sometimes. Alright, question number 13. Remember, visit means love at first sight. That is not true. I think it just means first sight. But definitely doesn't mean love in any way. All right, and that is correct. So, up to question number 14. All right, not bad. First encounter after the next, uh, after the last one. Not too shabby, not too shabby at all. All right, cool. Okay, Ragtimer, what do you have for me? What question? What mind teaser? What brain breaker do you have? Prince Cafe Card Carter is members only. Uh, that is true. I think that's the um, I think that's a cafe on the right when you go to the uh, to Queen Stella. I think that's the Magna Carta. That's definitely members only. I don't think there's a way to get in. Like, in the game? I don't think so. Um, yeah. 7,000 gil. I think then the next will be 8, and then the last will be 10, probably. If you uh, skip a step, as it were. Alright. Okay, then this should be Cactuar Island, I think. Is this Cactuar Island? Is this called Cactuar Island? Karua Island. I'm not sure if this is... I thought there was a Cactuar Island somewhere. Or is it in Final Fantasy VIII? Well, regardless, this is the one but last question. 
Cool. I'm happy. Almost done. But it didn't. It didn't take too long. All in all, I think I I ran around the world from forest to forest about maybe two hours in total to get all of them. Uh, so that's not too bad. Bobo bird is a bird that brings you fortune. That is false uh, because I have absolutely no idea what a bobo bird is. Never heard of a bobo bird. I don't know if it's in the game that that they mean that. Like, no, it's not in the game. That, that's not. It's false. It's definitely false. Correct. All right. Do I have to fight the ragtime mouse? I don't. Do I know? Oh, it's only seven. I thought it was eight now. 7,000. Gil. You're awesome. Thank you, Rectimer. I would say you're awesome as well, but it's a bit annoying to get you. But it's okay. Only one more to go. Yes! Finally, finally, finally! Alright. Yeah, we, we definitely needed to go to, uh, to a different continent to try... Uh, yeah, try forests we haven't done yet. But all in all, all in all, very, very easy uh, to get the Ragtime Mouse. Uh, definitely when you have the Flying Chocobo or the Hildegard. Last question. Hey, he even says it. That's nice, he even said it. You're gonna feed Ragtime Mouse. That's true, that's true. And not in the traditional way. But wait, is that true? Yeah. Not in the traditional way, but um, yeah. Definitely like this. I don't think I've ever had all 16 questions. I don't think I've ever had it. It would be funny if this was wrong now, like, no! <laughs> but yeah, 100% correct. Yay! 10,000 gil. You got 100% correct. Wow, you're awesome. So is that it? I guess that's it. No item, no... Yeah, no, no nothing, apparently. But, um... Yeah, that is definitely one episode that we've done a lot, a lot of progress because every single question counts towards our, uh, yeah, our finishing percentage. So um, that is definitely good. That's definitely good. Um, but now we are not too far from Mognet Central, so I'm going to get the. Is it the last crack, or do I need to do one more? No, I. I need to do another one. Uh, that leads to the the air garden. But right now, let's go to Chocobo. Uh, not Choco, <laughs> to uh, Magnet Central, which is right over here, another mountain crack, and uh, yeah, let's uh, let's start, well, at least the first bit, there we go, it should be fine, um, no, um, at least the first bit of the, um, of the Magnet Central side quest. No, wasn't that, not in the right spot, need to be more like this, good thing I have plenty of dead peppers. They should do it, at least. There we go, the crack crumbled and opened up a hole. Maybe I needed to do it twice? I don't think so, though. I, I think I might have been a bit too much to the, to the right. But yeah, there we go, Mognet Central. Mognet Central, nice, nice. Hello, Mogliana. I wonder if Mognet will go out of business. Kibble. Well, not if I can help it. Mogrek, this is Mognet Central. Yeah, I know. Mog Griffin. <laughs> Jeez. The grown-up Moogles don't know what to do because the equipment is broken. Yeah, I've heard, because Artemisian used it on himself and not on the machine, for whatever that means. Mosh. Uh, Mosh, didn't I encounter Mosh before? Wasn't he the Moogle in... I want to say Evil Forest. I, I, I kind of had a feeling I've encountered Mosh before, at least that name. I don't know. I wonder if Mognet will ever be the same. I don't know, Mosh. I, I don't know. Moss. <laughs> if we only had that item. So I need to find an item? Let's talk to Artemision. Hello, Artemision. I shouldn't have used it. <laughs> I, used ha I shouldn't have used so much of it on myself. I only did it because it makes my coso soft and shiny. But after I used it all up, the gear started to grind. As some sort of oil, I guess. As like the sorting machine that's broken. Well, I can't do anything more right now, but it's uh, step one to our Magnet Central quest, and it's uh, yeah the fourth mountain crack. So um, yeah, I could all go to Trino, get the other mountain crack. Do I can't do the last sea foam bubble? Hello, Shoko, you're far away, uh, because that's Shimmering Island, and I need to do that first. 
or I can go Chocograph hunting. Um, well, the episode is not almost over, but close-ish. Actually, let me go up. Um, oh, actually, I am going to get to my uh, to my airship um, because I don't really need it anymore. Uh, I'm going to do some Chocograph hunting later. Um, yeah, right now, why don't I just... Uh, yeah, why don't I just go to Trino and uh, fight the monster? Fight the last... Well, not the last fight, the third monster that I can. Ambusius, I think it's called. Uh, I also need to buy two more items. The magical fingertip and a ribbon, which I... No, no, not the chocobo. Get on the airship. Come on, get off. Um, so yeah, mag magical fingertip and the ribbon. There we go. So, um, yeah, also, near Trino, near Trino, I need to get a friendly ghost. I still need to do a friendly ghost. Um, I don't think I can find it in Dali. Uh, it's near Dali, Dali, I think the plains around Dali, uh, like the, 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 the basin uh, below Dali, I can, I can find it. I think I can find it, but not Dali itself, because that was the place for the Moo. Um, so I can try this. I don't know if I need to go... Um, in the forest, or I, if I can do the plains. Wait, am I? Is this Trino here? Yeah, it is. Um, so let's maybe get a fight. Let's try to get a fight and hopefully get the friendly ghost. Hmm, because still need to do that. Well, <laughs> ask and you shall receive. Well, that was lucky. Oh, well, I still need to do the fr friendly Garuda as well. That's near um, near Gizmaluk's Grotto. Where um, where the Grand Dragon is? I might do that. Well, not between episodes. Oh wow! Oh, that was really lucky. Wow. Uh, where do I have ores? Oh, good thing I still have a few because I saw. Well, I, I exchanged most of them for the uh, Aquamarines. That would have been awkward. It's strange that we hadn't um, encountered the ghost yet because we have roamed around this place. Much appreciated. Oh, he doesn't say hello to say hello to this or that. Cool. Well, that's two more to go. Friendly Garuda and Friendly Yan. Osmos. Not bad. Yeah, I think VV can equip his stronger weapon now? Or does he still need to learn Comet? Um, also, yeah, something I forgot to mention, but by doing uh, some fights, I actually have two extra cards. I have the... No, not the Wraith. Where is it? I have the Gimme Cat, because I encountered the Gimme Cat. And I have also this one, the Feather Circle, because I encountered... I don't know who dropped it. Not the Feather Circle, though. But yeah, I have those two cards extra, which is cool. So uh, only 48 left to go. Um, but yeah, let's check out VV. Uh, no, he's only to learn Meteor, and then after that... Oh no, that is a, this is his strongest weapon. Okay, cool. Well, I'll, I'll probably have his uh, Mace of Zeus soon, because that's a chocograph. And I'm gonna do that in the next episode, so yeah. Um, let's, uh, let's, fight the, uh, let's fight the last monster uh, in disc 3, uh, because we still need to fight uh, in disc 4. We need to find, uh, not fight, fight a, uh, a monster as well. But I think this is the, um, um, yeah. The, no, well, not the last one. This is the third one, yeah. Uh, because after this, uh, in, in Disc 4, we need to find the Behemoth in the Night House. Uh, I don't think I can steal from Ducius. I'm not sure. I'm honestly not gonna... I can I can try, actually. Um, I have Auto Life. I have also Regen. Uh, that should be absolutely fine. I have Haste as well. Uh, I don't know what he does. I think he does Wind. I think he might do wind. I can equip an Is it Chimera Armlet? No, it's Holy. And Shadow. Ugh, it should be fine though. Fire Thunder damage. Um, do, do I have anything windy that I can uh, Corona it? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm, I might as well wear Corona it. How many do I have? I still have one left. Yeah, so that's no wind, no Holy, and half Shadow. And I have Ribbon as well. Oh, it absorbs wind. Uh... Well, I do like Corona, regardless. What's this? Fire Thunder Water. And I'm gonna... Actually, if I do Fire Thunder Water, and this is Fire Thunder Water, Fire Ice Thunder Holy. Yeah, that should... Well, he is quite well equipped. Uh, unless he does, like, poison or stuff like that, that would suck, but I can always fight him again. 
All right, let's try this. Let's try this. Um, I want to fight these monsters. Uh, yes, Sedane. Yeah, I'm going to try stealing. Might as well. Uh, I don't think he has anything. Or at least nothing useful. Yeah, cool. Cool. Wow, this episode. I think we'll have skipped like... Well, not skipped. We have... We will probably have like 5 6%. Towards our completion goal, so we're almost at 60%. So <laughs> that's quite impressive. Yeah, that's uh Bio, yeah. I, I thought he might do poison. I wasn't sure. Should be fine though. You can always heal plus I regen as well. Full high potion. Okay, I can steal. Okay, let me steal one more time. Maybe he has something useful. I doubt it. Uh, but then I'm just gonna kick his but level 4 holy he's in level 75 so that should be fine unless he's in 76 then he'll have some holy against him but nope that missed antidote nah just want to write some regular items uh, but yeah my fever actually let me show you how much my thievery is uh, I tested it out and it's not that good yet I think it's gonna be around uh, 5,500, 6,000, uh, probably less. Ooh, he flies all of a sudden, that's funny. Um, but yeah, I still need to steal a lot more. And apparently it's, uh, I actually checked it out, I, I researched it. And it's not the level that counts, it's uh, Zidane's speed that counts towards thievery. Uh, because it's the number amount of times you've stolen. Yeah, ooh, almost 6,000, not bad. So it's the number of the amount of times, times you've stolen. Uh, multiplied by his speed divided by two and that's the damage you do um, there we go that's inducious um, so yeah I, I need I need um, like gear that increases its speed I'm gonna do afterwards uh, eventually probably definitely during uh, the Ozma fight um, so yeah I still need to steal more and and that's basically it so it's not too bad I think I, I uh, calculated that I stole an almost 400 times, which is not that much. Um, oh yeah, running shoes as well, not really necessary, but good. All right, um, I'm gonna leave this episode right here uh, because we're out of time. Um, but yeah, next episode, we're gonna get uh, two more items, the magical fin fingertip and the ribbon, hopefully. And then, uh, yeah, some chocograph uh, hunting, the final four chocographs. Then get to Chocobo's Paradise. Uh, we played some cards against the fat Chocobo there as well. Um, but yeah, basically um, really racking up those points. So yeah, this is the end of the episode. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, and yeah, I hope to see you all in the next episode. Bye-bye.